Every day I get to sit and think about how the Earth formed, and that's fun. One of the questions we're trying to answer is why is the Earth different from our neighboring planets, and why is it different from extrasolar planets that we see? We believe that the process of growing the Earth was different than the details of growing other planets, and that it's these key intermediate stages that led us to our water-rich habitable planet that we have today. Planet formation involves collisions at all scales, from dust grains colliding and sticking, kilometer-sized asteroids growing, all the way up to protoplanets colliding to make the final planets we see today. Giant impacts can shape what a planet is made out of. It can blow off atmospheres, it can add atmospheres, it can dictate the chemical components of the planets that we see. The way that I study planet formation is to use a combination of laboratory experiments and computer models. We do experiments to recreate the high pressure and temperature conditions that are achieved in natural impact events. And we use this information in computer codes to be able to model the planetary scales that we can't make in the lab. We can do these at national facilities like the Sandia Z machine and the Lawrence Livermore Ignition Facility. And these let us reach conditions that are obtained over minutes during planet formation, but are key to understanding the composition of the Earth that we see today. One of the most interesting things about planetary science is that it involves the interaction of many different subdisciplines in science. And so you can be a planetary scientist while being a high pressure physicist or an atmospheric chemist or an oceanographer. And you can study different aspects of planets. So you don't need to wake up one morning saying, I want to be a planetary scientist. You can be any type of scientist and actually think about the problem of the Earth as a whole and understanding how the planet grew and evolved is part of understanding our own impact on it.